Before wins all the bites, how exciting is that for for you? And you know, obviously, it's it's great to have that run of success, isn't it? Yeah, I think when you look at the league table, I think you know, looking back at the games, we kind of needed them to sort of be in the position that we find ourselves in. We knew. I think going back a few weeks ago when we lost to Morton, you know, we had to sort of step up a wee bit and to go and win the three games on the road like we did and then pick up the points again on Saturday, you know, a Friday night, sorry, kind of shows where we're at now and, you know, that's what we have to be consistent throughout the season because I think the league table kind of shows it and everyone's shown that it's going to be a really difficult league this year and I think ultimately it's going to come down to the team who's more consistent at periods of time when it's really important. What's made the difference, do you think? No, really. I just think, as I said, it's, it's hard to put a you know a thing on it. We've we've kind of went really sort of solid and hard to beat again. You know, I think the, the free clean sheets in the last four games as well has kind of helped. So I think that's probably one of the first things. You know, you build on that, and then you've got goal scorers in the team that can can win us games like Friday night. Billy pops up. You know, wasn't many chances, but when you got a player like him, you kind of only needs one. So yeah, I think it's just really that, and you know, taking the confidence of the free away trips to pick the results from that and we just have to build on that really and take it into Saturday because you know it's going to be a difficult game again so you know it's one of those now where we just have to continue to do what we do and fingers crossed we can you know sort of get a good result on Saturday and keep us up at the top end of the table. Clean sheets obviously is good news for you, is the pressure on now though? Uh, no, 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 listen as I said it's, I always enjoy a clean sheet but at the end of the day if we're winning games I think that's the most important thing because like I've said many times, you know, sat in front of here and that since I've been at the club, it's about trying to get out of this league. And, you know, if we're keeping clean sheets, then it's more likely that we'll win games as well. So, you know, that's really important. You know, it's nice as a goalkeeper to do that. So if I'm doing that and the team are scoring at the other end, then we're going to be winning games. And that's really important. Cool. Obviously, they're adjusting quickly to life in the championship. I mean, what prospect are they for you, do you think? Yeah, I think, you know, they're, they're a well-organised team when we played them here as well. You could see that, you know, Jim McIntyre has got a lot of experience. You know, he's done really, really well when he was at Ross County. And I think you can see that with Cove, they sort of started a wee bit slow. Then he's kind of found a balance in the team and, you know, his team selection sort of a bit more consistent now and they've had their results. But, you know, it's one of those where, as I said, it's, we just have to continue to do what we're doing. And fingers crossed, you know, come Saturday we can, we can get another win and keep us at the top end of the table. 4-1 was the last result last time around. Do you think they're going to be a, a more difficult prospect this time? Yeah, I think the, the, like the teams that have come up, you know, you kind of learn really. I think teams that get promoted always come in with a bit of momentum, you know, from the following season. I think Queen's Park have done it as well in this league and it's, it's like that, you know, they build on that. But when you, you start losing games and, you know, struggling a little bit, which at the beginning of the season when they did, you know, it was like that, then, but they've managed to organise themselves. Jim's, as I said, very, very experienced, you know, and the players around about him, he's found a style, and they've got results that put them sort of within the sort of middle of the mix, really, but the whole table itself, it's really, really tight still after the first quarter, really, so, as I said, it's about being consistent, and, you know, and it's going to these places and picking up results, which, at the end of the season, could mean massive. Great, thank you. No worries, thank you, yeah. Wonderful.